So that's the way on how to cook palindikincha. Now let's talk about on what is palindikincha. In today's generation, most of the people loves to eat meaty foods. Some people use to partner the meat with a vegetable that can regulate their digestion just like lettuce. The newly created product is here that is a combination of meat and a vegetable that can also regulate digestion which is the palindikincha. It is a homemade recipe that contains ground meat, egg, garlic, salt, pepper, flour, and celery as the featured ingredient. Compared to a normal patty, the palindikincha has more healthy ingredients, especially the celery that contains vitamin C, beta-carotene, and flavonoids. It also has approximately 25 anti-inflammatory compounds that can offer protection against inflammation in the body. Although pati de chai has meat, pectin-based polysaccharides in celery, including a compound known as apcuman, have been shown to decrease instances of stomach ulcers, improving the lining of stomach and modulate stomach secretions in animal studies, plus the generous amounts of soluble and insoluble fiber that the celery contains. That's why it is best for the customers. It could stand out on the market as it has cheaper price and best to partner with rice. We all know that Filipinos love cheap foods but has delicious taste. It's also the best for the people who are on a diet and also for kids who love meaty foods. It is also affordable for the customers, especially students, because it is only 5 pesos for each. They can also partner it with bread or rice, just like shawarma rice, because of its appearance and the ingredients it contains. So that is the Padre Dikin Chai.